I want to find a particular sequence. And I've got lots of bins here and I've got lost. I can't remember where I put it. Now obviously I could look into each of them and find it. I could possibly type the words sequence in there and maybe it'll come up with all the things that have got sequences in it. Let's just put it into text view. Oh yeah, there's some sequences now. Definitely found some of those. Or I could use a new type of bin, which is called a search bin. So I'm going to go file, new, search bin. And it gives you the option to set up a bin which updates itself depending on what you're doing. So I'm going to say, well, let's look through something. I've just clicked on the words all metadata. You can see all the options that I've got. I'm going to go for media type. And I'm going to say media type sequence. Oakley doakley. That's made up a media type sequence bin. And oh, there's all my sequences. They're in other bins all over the place, but this has now brought them all together in one place. They're still in the other bins, but now I can make sure that wherever they are, they'll pop up here. Let's make up a new sequence and I'll call it some gibberish. And obviously put a clip on there, whatever. Let's go back to that search bin. That search bin now has that sequence in it. And you can do search bins on all sorts of stuff. So you've got any of the metadata in the clip, or the audio data, the comments, any of this lot, you can make up a search bin. You know, I could do clip type as well as video codec. And it will produce a search bin that would do that. And it would update as you added media into the project.